I am here in Manhattan and we are testing the latest and greatest for hardware for 13.2.9 and we're gonna see how FSD handles this whole Manhattan scenarios here so buckle up and enjoy the video guys so after getting this car with hardware 4 FSD 13 this is the first time I'm trying it in Manhattan and you know Manhattan is crazy there are like so many people the car already decided to change the lane and move to the left side this is the right thing to do because that's a bus lane where we were so we are going as you can see hopefully FSD will be able to see that bump but it didn't human didn't do that too so we're going as you can see So we got stuck for this red light and we're gonna go proceed and go straight. And we're gonna see how Tesla FSD drives here in the city. Because I live in suburb and FSD normally does very good on suburb, especially with even hardware three, hardware four, both drives like very nice. But in city last video, I faced so much problem with my hardware three vehicle. The car was always trying to stay in the middle of two lane and then gets confused. There are like so many issues with the hardware three. Um, my car was also very old 2022 model and people are saying I need alignment or something like that. There are like so many issues. But now this is a brand new car brand new cameras everything is brand new and with hardware 4 with the latest software 13.2.9 i expect fsd to be performed very well so hopefully this will be at 15 minutes drive and we're gonna see how fsd handles the rest of the drive so buckle up and enjoy the video guys So these roads are very busy. It's like 34th Street in Manhattan. So one of the busiest road in Manhattan. So you, you'll, you'll face like a lot of traffic, a lot of people and you know, like a lot of delays. So we just have to stick here and you know, face all of these with FSD. As a human, we get, you know, like, like very annoyed with everything, but as a robot, you can't get annoyed, you know? So we're going and if it is slowly moving, you know, like because there are like a lot of car in front of us. So we just have to wait and go slowly. So the good thing is like FSD can recognize that bus lane and didn't try to get over there like you know like as a human or like a, there are like so many people drives in the bus lane but FSD understand that this is a bus lane and we can just go over there and FSD decided to stay here even though there are like a lot of traffic FSD didn't try to cut off which is very good.
very good. Now we are kind of stuck here. So that lady was saying, let's go. And I first thought like, he's, she's probably telling us to stop. And I was about to press that acceleration, but FSD immediately proceeded. Like very funny incident. Like that lady was like, let's go. <laughs> I'm like kind of stuck in between those two, you know, like intersection. Uh, very nice though, but FSD, you know, like was able to escape that situation. Very, very good job there. A uh, little bit of confusion because that human was like, you know, trying to tell us go with hand gesture and everything. I heard a lot of stories that FSD kind of understand like hand gesture, but you know, now he's saying object in path detected, take over to proceed. We're going to see if FSD actually proceed. Um, but it is proceeding. I don't know why it keeps saying us that object detected. So it means like there are something on the road and uh, you need to take over to proceed, you know, like if it doesn't want to break the car or something like that, but still the car proceeded. But I don't know why it is telling us that there is an object detected on the road. But you will see like the stop and go is very nice. You feel very relaxed. You don't need to do anything. And they're like not like there are like a lot of people. But if it is not getting confused or, you know, doing any weird stuff, even though it was almost getting stuck on the intersection, but immediately understand I can proceed. So just proceed it perfectly. So, yeah, we're just 10 minutes away from our destination. Until now, the car didn't do anything wrong or anything dangerous, which is very good and hopefully the car will be able to take us from our destination without any human interaction very very good job till now so we are going guys also if you're just watching this video for the first time i would request please hit that subscribe button that will be amazing because as a new content creator i need your support so please that's absolutely free hit that subscribe button thank you Okay, so we are going this time. It didn't get confused with those hand gesture or anything like that The car immediately proceeded. No problem at all. Very good job So we are going as you can see there is no confusion till now and yeah guys FSD is performing very good So let's see if FSD blocks this intersection kind of thing. No, nope. very nice So it immediately proceeded breaks over here slowly and moved up very very nice job there so we're gonna make a left on madison avenue and we're gonna see how if it handles that because normally it's a two-way traffic so people's gonna come from our opposite side so if it needs to stay and uh, be calm and when there is no vehicle from the opposite side we can kind of make a left turn so we're gonna try those two and we're gonna see how FSD handles the rest of the drive. Eight minutes away till now, very, very, like too much traffic here in Manhattan. Uh, but you know, like FSD is handling everything. We cannot just drive it smoothly. I really prefer to make a video while the car is just doing left, right and everything, not stacking too much, but still, you know, like if you run a robo taxi here in Manhattan, this is how FSD needs to handle the whole driving scenario. So we are going, guys. This is our biggest Macy's 
in New York in 34th Street. If you're from the city or if you ever came to New York, you probably know that. On our left side, that's the Macy's and is the biggest store in United States. So we're going, guys. Pretty nice. People are still, again, another intersection. The light just changed to yellow. That lady was telling us to stop, but we didn't stop because she probably didn't tell us to stop like behind me there are like other cars so that lady told them to stop so if you recognize that it could just easily get confused with that hand gesture that oh i just have to stop there uh, but fsd was you know like very smart enough that it understand that hand gesture and just moved through it with that yellow light changing like you know like it changed from green to yellow and yellow to it turns on the left indicator. I really don't know why. We're still one block away from our um, Madison um, Avenue, but it's still FSD turns on the left indicator. Uh, people are crossing. I'm just gonna try to press that brake if FSD tries to do something bad. So, you know, being cautious. This is supervised. So whenever people are crossing or something, you just need to take over or be cautious to take over. You know, like so. We're going. The light is changed. The light changed and. Uh, I really don't know why FSD turns on the left indicator. We can just make left here. This is um, Fifth Avenue and Fifth Avenue goes to downtown. It doesn't go and now it turns off. Very good, very, very good, like a human. But I, on the first place, don't know why it turns on the left indicator though. So there are like so many people crossing the road. My foot is on the brake so that if FSD tries to do something stupid, I'm just gonna take over. But the car is behaving perfectly like a human so everything seems very nice people are crossing road we are waiting for traffic light to be changed and hopefully we are just six minutes away from our destination and we're just waiting that fsd will do everything perfectly so people are still crossing still crossing still crossing just waiting right over here for the traffic light to be changed and then we can proceed so very nice like human stopped because the you know the sign changed but normally in Manhattan people doesn't stop that far like they're like gonna probably run and just change up you know like going and crossing the road we're gonna make a left turn I really hope there is a left turn sign here or light here so that FSD would make this left turn but there will be people crossing from the left side so FSD probably need to wait a little bit for those human to be cross the road but we're gonna find out how FSD handles. This is a critical thing. So we're gonna see how FSD makes this left turn, guys. column so sound quality style so we're gonna make a left turn FSD kind of crossed that white line and now we're gonna make a left turn but we need to wait for the opposite side traffic we're gonna see how FSD handles this because there are like a lot of car from the opposite side and if it is kind of now the light changed to yellow and we're gonna see very good very human like driving you see that the light changes but because we already passed that white line fsd didn't block the whole road and completely goes and now changing the lane to go fast like amazing driving guys oh okay that yellow cap kind of feels like he's gonna change the lane wow and now we're changing one more lane to go to the right side because there is a car parked over there very human like driving like i would do the same but i would probably in the first place don't go to the left lane all the way i would just probably stay in this lane because in manhattan normally there are like a lot of parked car on our left side and right side so both sides so we cannot just go to that lane but if you probably thought like oh that's like emptiest space we can just go over uh, there. So we are going, guys. Till now, the car is doing everything perfectly. No problem at all. 
pattern is something that is very critical for human driver like a lot of people I talk to um, like they're saying like I can't drive in Manhattan but you can see Tesla FSD with just camera and no lighter is handling scenarios like this perfectly Sunday so much traffic so many people but still FSD is handling everything nicely and perfectly So we are going till now. We're gonna make a left on which street? 45th Street. So we're gonna see how FSD handles that. So if it's just trying and again turn on the left indicator, really don't know why, but now it is proceeding. I don't know why FSD is trying to do that, but there are like certain times you just turn on the left indicator and trying to do something. Again, you, you can see that like we're not gonna make a left here. We're gonna go two more blocks and then go and make this left turn. You see, like it is still turning on the left indicator. I, I'm, I'm confused here, but if it is not, it's just turning on and turning off for some reason. But we're gonna make a left turn on the next block, next block, 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 next block, block. Okay, that's next block. We're gonna make a left turn on next block and we're gonna see how FSD handles the rest of the drive, guys, because we're very close. We're just here and we need to find a parking. So hopefully you guys are enjoying. Now we're gonna play a game. This is a game I always love to play with my viewers. I'm gonna tell you a number and you're just gonna comment below that number in the comment section. For today's episode, the number will be seven. So just write down seven or whatever you want or what kind of video you want to watch in my channel or any suggestion you have for this kind of videos. So please don't forget to write down seven in the comment section or anything you want me to know. So we're gonna go straight now. Uh, the light just changed. There are like few traffic in front of us, I guess. And then we're gonna make a left turn. There is a pole, I guess, in front of us or something in the road. Um, we're gonna see how FSD actually handles these scenarios because these kind of things are robotaxi needs to handle. So you'll see that human YOLO driver just cut off from the left. So we're gonna see if FSD can do that just just amazing guys you see like how confident it is just cutting that scenarios from there like completely going to the left side like a human and then now we're making a left turn you need to get over here now people are walk crossing we're gonna make a left turn we need to wait a little bit very nice job very very good job like immediately make that left turn wait for like one or two seconds like slowly going and then immediately make that left turn perfectly without any problem guys so hopefully you enjoyed this video there is no intersect intervention i had to take over or there is any dangerous things i just took over not a single time and thank you for watching guys hopefully you guys enjoy please make sure you hit the subscribe button and like button that really helps the algorithm i love you so much and have a wonderful wonderful day